Welcome to the Thermodynamics XT300 series torch maintenance instruction video. The purpose of this presentation is to clearly illustrate the correct step-by-step -step procedure for the proper assembly of the XT300 series consumable torch parts and cartridge. XT series plasma torches are engineered to provide consistent and reliable precision cutting of various materials and metal thicknesses. The key to consistent performance of this product is largely dependent on the correct removal, assembly and replacement of the consumable cartridge and its inner workings during parts changes. High performance reliability and cutting quality will be regularly achieved by following the simple step-by-step -step procedure. Index the torch to a convenient location with adequate space beneath the end of the torch. If the system has an ohmic clip, remove it from the shield cup. Before removing the consumable cartridge from the torch body, the system must be disabled to prevent coolant from flowing through the system. Refer to the original equipment manufacturer's operating manual for this procedure. Once the collar is completely loosened, Pull firmly downward to remove the cartridge assembly, being cautious not to strike the end of the cartridge onto the work surface. Expect a small amount of coolant to run out of the coolant tube. To disassemble the cartridge, place the cartridge tool over the inner ribbed collar. Firmly grasp the shield cup and unscrew the cup in a clockwise direction using the assembly tool. Once the cup is removed, use the narrow end of the cartridge tool to press the consumable stack out of the cartridge assembly by placing the tool on a flat surface and pressing the cartridge down onto the tool. To remove the remaining parts from the shield cup, press firmly onto the shield cap to release it and the gas distributor from the shield cup. The consumable parts are now separated from the cartridge. It is very important to assemble the consumable parts and cartridge in relatively clean conditions. Hands, tools, and work surfaces should be free of soot, slag, and other dirt particles that could become embedded in the O-ring seals and compromise the performance of the torch. The consumable parts should be inspected periodically and replaced when necessary to maintain consistent cut quality. These parts consist of the electrode, plasma gas distributor, tip, shield gas distributor, and shield cap. Each of these parts are packaged separately when new and arrive with a light coating of oxygen compatible synthetic lubricant already applied to the O-rings. It is recommended that the parts remain in their containers until they are ready for assembly. When reinstalling existing parts, it is recommended that a light coating of lubricant, Thermal Dynamics part number 9-4893, be reapplied to the O-ring surfaces. The lubricant should be applied very conservatively. Over application can result in clogging the small orifices in the parts. A thin film is all that is required. This can be achieved by rubbing a small amount of lubricant between the thumb and forefinger until it becomes transparent. Gently turn each part against the lubricated fingers to apply a light film. The individual parts can now be assembled. Begin by placing the electrode into the plasma gas distributor. Next, place this assembly into the tip. Now add the shield gas distributor and finally the shield cap. Be sure they are all firmly seated. This five piece assembly can now be placed into the consumables cartridge. Hold the cartridge upright while inserting the assembly in and press the consumable parts firmly into the cartridge. Observe the interface between the end of the cartridge and the tip. The O-ring should not be visible. Finally, 
Tighten the shield cup to the cartridge using the cartridge tool to hold the inner ribbed ring and twist the shield cup until it is snug. Do not over tighten. When the assembly is done correctly, the shield cap will protrude from the shield cup between 65 and 85 thousandths of an inch, or 1.7 to 2 millimeters. Reattaching the consumables cartridge is a straightforward task, but a few precautions will ensure a successful leak-free installation. Carefully inspect the torch body in the areas around the O-rings for damage or debris. Apply a thin film of the oxygen-compatible lubricant as described earlier in the consumables assembly. Slide the consumables cartridge onto the torch body and carefully twist the collar in a counterclockwise direction. Take particular care not to cross-thread the collar during this process. A visual inspection of the torch just above the ribbed collar can help to determine if the cartridge is properly installed. The large diameter o-ring on the torch body should only be partly visible when the cartridge is properly attached to the torch body. By following these simple steps, the XT300 series plasma torch will produce precision cuts consistently and reliably with a minimum of downtime.